Continuing our series on the use of EXE, we will now demonstrate the use of the free text iDevice. Most of the content of any learning resource serves to establish context, deliver instruction, or provide general information. The free text iDevice is therefore the most basic and the probably most used iDevice since it provides the framework within which learning activities are built and delivered. The free text iDevice is EXE's easy to use text editor, as we see here, and it contains many of the functions that are already that we are familiar with from whatever text editor we are used to using. So there's support for 17 fonts and seven font sizes, as well as italics, bold, underline, colored text, and highlighting. And a useful facility is the ability to insert special characters, such as the Enye, as we see here. There's also support for the creation of tables and the manipulation of the tables. In many cases, the institution that will be implementing EXE will already have some text which they will just want to use for the EXE module. So let's look at some text which has already been um, created, which is the welcome message for the Alejo San Diego Hospital. And we'll do a copy from here and paste using the basic paste function of EXE. Control V works the same way. So as we see here, we have the text from the document we had, and it has carried over the formatting. Now, there may be cases where we do not want to carry over the formatting because we may want to standardize in the EXE module. So to demonstrate that, let's go back to our file and copy some text which is highly formatted, as we see here. So we'll do a Control c and let me first show you what it looks like if we paste it using the plain paste function. So as you see, the formatting is carried over. However, if we use the paste from Word, only some of the formatting is present. As we see, we still have the table and we have the text but the colors and the special fonts have been removed. The most extreme way to paste, if we don't want any formatting at all, is to use paste as plain text. And as you see here, the special formatting has all disappeared. And this is the only thing which will be pasted into the EXE module, as we see here. There's also a facility to remove um, text, spot removal of text. So if we go back to the formatted text, let's highlight this. If we select this button, which is remove formatting, as you see, it has removed the formatting that was previously present. So we can do that for quick removal of formatting. Further information on the various buttons here can be had from the help key. And there is a very comprehensive description of all the buttons that are available on the free text iDevice. So this concludes our tutorial on the free text iDevice.